welcome to true projects in this video we will be learning about secure crypto biometric system for cloud computing introduction business and individuals rely significantly on cloud services for cost effective data storage and management in the modern era of cloud computing this convenience however comes with a huge difficulty of guaranteeing data security storing sensitive information on the cloud such as biometric data exposes it to potential misuse by unauthorized individuals or cloud service providers to address this issue this project introduces a secure crypto biometric system aimed at preventing unwanted access to user data the proposed system transforms and safeguards biometric data using a combination of hidden markov model algorithms clustering techniques and encryption methods ensuring that legitimate verification systems can access and verify the information adding an extra layer of data protection in cloud computing objective the project's goal is to create safe crypto biometric system for cloud computing that protects user biometric data the system intends to convert biometric data into a encrypted format by using hidden markov model algorithm clustering approaches and encryption methods this encrypted data can be validated by authentic verification systems using the correct decoder key rendering it unavailable to unauthorized users including prospective hackers the initiative aims to improve cloud data security particularly when dealing with sensitive biometric information and to prevent illegal access and misuse of such data these are the requirements of the project in hardware requirements operating system of windows processor of i5 and above ram of 4 gb and above hard disk of 20 gb and above are needed in software we need python idel of 3.7 version these are the algorithms used in the project first one is hidden markov model the hmm algorithm is employed for extracting features from biometric templates stored in the universal background model biometric database it helps in modeling and analyzing the underlying patterns and characteristics of the biometric data next one is bomb welk and lbg clustering these are the techniques used with the hmm algorithm to refine the model's parameters and improve the accuracy of feature extraction from the biometric templates next one is principal component analysis pca is used for feature selection reducing the dimensionality of extracted features while retaining their most relevant information this aids in optimizing the storage and processing of the biometric data next one is fuzzy commitment template protection this process involves encoding the selected features using a private key making it challenging for unauthorized users to interpret the data even if they gain access to encrypted biometric templates next one is gaussian mixture model which is gmm the encoded features are trained using gmm algorithm to build a probabilistic model of the biometric data this facilitates accurate verification and authentication of users based on their biometric features Coming to the methodology we have designed these modules for execution. First one is upload biometric database. Using this module we will upload biometric templates database to application. Next one is run feature extraction. Using this module we will extract features from templates. Third one is run feature selection and BCH encoder. In this module using PCA we will select features and then encode the features. Fourth one is encode training using GMM and key. Encoded features will get key and then trained with GMM. Fifth one is BCH decoder verification. Using this module, we will be uploading test data set and then decode and perform verification. For execution of the project, first open the code folder. This is the code folder of the project and this is the fingerprint data set. On this, we will be training the module. and this is the model file which contains the algorithm information these files can be loaded into the project code during run time to utilize the trained models and this is the test images data set for these images we will be predicting the biometric of that person and this is the python main code file and this is the run.bat file instead of executing the project in command line interface we have created windows batch file for execution so double click on it for execution This is the graphical user interface of the project with this we can interact with the program and this is created by using tickintel library in the python so first we need to click on the button upload biometric database select the data set and click on select folder here data set is uploaded and here we can see total persons biometric templates found in the database are 10 and here are the person details now click on the button run features extraction to extract the features here 
we can see features are extracted. Now click on the button Run Feature Selection and BCH Encoder to extract the features. Select Important Features. Here, uh, prior to PCA selection, we had 784 features. After using PCA algorithm, we got 60 important attributes. Now click on the button AES ECC Encoder Training using GMM and Key button to encode features and then train GMM and this GMM will get encrypted using ECC and AES algorithms. Here we can see time taken by AES algorithm and ECC algorithm and GMM encrypted data. Now click on BCH decoder verification button to upload template and get verification output. Here I am selecting the image too and clicking on open. Here this image is predicted as biometric template belongs to person 4. Close this image and now click on AES and ECC encryption time graph. Here. On x-axis, it represents the encryption algorithm names and on y-axis, it represents the execution time. In both the algorithms, ECC execution time is less. Close the GUI. Conclusion The proposed safe crypto biometric system efficiently protects biometric templates stored on cloud servers, hence improving data security. The GMM object is used for verification by system and it is encrypted using two separate algorithms which are ECC and AES which means elliptic curve cryptography and advanced encryption standard. When the performance of both algorithms in terms of execution time is compared, ECC outperforms AES. The project effectively illustrates the capability of securing biometric data in cloud computing environments, protecting sensitive data from illegal access and exploitation. The use of encryption techniques maintain the GMM object secrecy and integrity, making it difficult for attackers to understand and change biometric templates even if they obtain access to cloud servers. This safe crypto biometric system. Thank you for watching video. For more projects, please visit our website www.trueprojects.in. For updates on latest project videos, Please visit True Projects YouTube channel and subscribe.